but he started to sacrifice a little bit of his game. You know, we know Luca. he led the league in scoring, of course, almost 34 points a game. We know he can do that. But the question, I think, becomes for greatness like Doncic is whether or not, if you would, they will sacrifice, case for the betterment of everybody else. And I, that's the biggest adjustment, in my opinion, that Luca made, started to give Kai the basketball and give him his time handling the basketball and making plays. And they just, they seem like uh, the best duo in the NBA. And I think a lot of it has to do with Luca making that sacrifice and um, everybody else buying into what they do as a, as players. It seems like th- that's a, a distinguishing factor when you look at some of the greats. You played with some of the greats. You played against some no. of the greats. Is that it? I mean, that, that ability to trust your teammates more and, and really lead not just, you know, with the ball in your hands, but putting them in position right. to help you win. Excellent question. I, I, I tell you what, Casey, okay, I'll put it to you this way. Who won the championship last year? Nuggets. Nuggets did. Who is their 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 main guy? Who is their that's, their their top guy? Yep, that's who I was thinking about. The Jokic. Yep. He 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 makes everybody better, right? He's a pass first guy, and what it does is, I think, is it gives your other guys confidence to go out and do what they do. One guy has never won a championship. It's always collectively when you find a way to be crowned as a champion, but. I, I, I just think you, you can't put a value on that, how, how, how valuable it is to trust. And you get super teams and great teams that will trust each other. I, I'll show you a champion. And that's the bottom line for Luka and the Mavericks.